Twenty years ago, a life for Jeannie French from Brookings has changed. She decided to be a single mother and adopt her children from different countries. When I saw that they would work with singles, and I was a little older at the time, and they would work with people that were a little older, um, and now, and now, I mean, people that are up to you know sixty can adopt. So, um, but at the time, I was in my early forties, and lots of places wouldn't work with you, and they wouldn't work with single um, females. The oldest one and Jameson are um, from Vietnam. My oldest one is twenty-two. Uh, Jameson is nineteen. Um, and then Jacob uh, is 12, and he is from China. Sometimes it gets really awkward because you know they'll be asking where are you from, like what country, what ethnicity you are, but you just want to say where you're currently from. So I'll say Brookings, but then they'll be like, where are you really from? And then I'll be like, oh, you mean I'm from Vietnam. And they're like, yeah. <laughs> With my oldest one, um, I got a picture and they said, this child is available. You know, are you interested? And uh, of course you say, yes. I mean, he looked beautiful. And then with Jameson, we got a phone call and it was the same thing. A lot of the places in Vietnam are in like poverty areas. So probably not doing so well, living off a garbage dump maybe, or on the streets, something like that. But in, when I was growing up, there was a TV show called My Three Sons. Okay. And I always said I'd have my three sons. So I, I, I don't know, that's just how it worked out. And yeah, I definitely feel fortunate for the opportunity of like, that I've been given through the adoption. Um, sometimes I notice the differences uh, because my friends are come from a tr tr traditional family where two parents, um, two Asian parents, and then they're Asian. Um, but yeah, I definitely feel fortunate for what I've been given. Well, sometimes I thought I was crazy because they're a lot of work, and I'm it. Um, and our house wasn't always picked up and neat and tidy and because um, there's just not enough time. Um, but I, my life has certainly been enriched, and um, it was one of the best decisions I, that I ever made was to adopt children.